The, I just want to say to all my viewers and all my subscribers and followers, Happy New Year everybody. It's 2018, so I wish you all good luck. For me, 2017 has been a great year with more ups than downs. And I'm looking forward to 2018. Unfortunately, I know not everybody on this planet is able to say the same, same thing. And I really dislike uh, dishing out empty promises like things will get better or hang in there and you will make it or think positive and things will be fine. The sad truth is some of us will never make it. And harsh as it sounds, it is just a sad reality. So for 2018, I would like to remind all of you that all we have in the end is our persistence to make it, whether it is successful or not. In this great struggle of life, the most important thing is that you keep trying, even against the most seemingly impossible odds. This applies to everybody, whether you consider yourself to be happy and successful or not. Sometimes life throws tragedies at you that are out of your own control. Some people are happy because of circumstances that are out of their own control. So in my opinion, the greatest tragedy is giving up because that is the only tragedy that is completely in our own control. Of course, I wish all of you the best. It may sound a little grim, but I think there is some truth to it if you think about it. Now this year has been a good year for my YouTube channel too, because my amount of subscribers has nearly doubled in one year, which is a very great good thing. I went from less than 1000 to uh, almost 2000 at the moment of speaking, just a little bit below 2000. And I will try to keep improving and make more interesting material and try to obtain, of course, bigger and better and more unique and rare species. It's hard to say what 2018 will bring, although you've seen me rear a lot of moths on YouTube that have yet to emerge this year, like the Citheronia Belenodon, Citheronia Azteca, the uh, Pseudobunea, the Lobobunea, the Pseudembrasia, all of them are overwintering. I have some very rare species too, like Automeris patagoniensis, um, and some very interesting and unique silk moth like Hemileuca electra. So yeah, all in all stay tuned. 2018 may bring some interesting butterflies as well, although I'm still more of a moth person than a butterfly person. It would be nice to experiment more with butterflies, of course, Butterflies have a different viewer base than moths and I would like to cater to everyone, to everyone who likes to uh, study butterflies and moths, so I will not ignore any group. I haven't made any videos on Microlepidoptera yet because I don't know anything about them, but I may try. Either way, follow my channel and you'll see what happens. This was just my short message to all of you. And thank you for watching and subscribing and whatever. I appreciate it. See you next year, or actually already this year. Bye.